It's all systems go for New Mexico's Spaceport America. This week, the state awarded a contract for construction of the spaceport's $32 million passenger terminal and hangar. Construction of the runway is already underway. KRQE pilot reporter Bob Martin is just back from the spaceport and has an update on the progress. The giant 10,000-foot runway at the burgeoning Spaceport America near TRC is already quickly becoming a reality. It was just a patch of dirt a couple of months ago, but giant tractors and paving machines are quickly turning this into a place where in 2011, rocket ships are to begin carrying tourists outside the planet's atmosphere. Virgin Galactic is already preparing both a jet-powered mothership and, under its belly, a rocket ship to carry tourists up for about five minutes of floating around in outer space. The road from TRC that the first visitors to the spaceport will travel, once miles of dirt ruts, is now almost all paved. But this is space tourism, after all. And space tourists need a space terminal. That's the next big thing going up here. Earlier this week, the New Mexico Spaceport Authority awarded the contract for building the ultra-futuristic spaceport terminal and hangar complex. The spaceport director says Summit West of Albuquerque had the lowest bid. The 110,000-square-foot facility will house Virgin Galactic's world headquarters and provide a passenger terminal and storage for the spacecraft. The director says the project will generate several hundred new jobs. Bob Martin, KRQE News 13, near TRC. And there are still some contracts that haven't been handed out at the $200 million Spaceport America. They include the communications and security systems and buildings for security officers and firefighters.